Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is your Captain Jack Zambath from the Flight Tech Dinners and Noise 11.0. I just want to show you what I've been working on these past few days. Uh, as you know, in DIN, you can turn any polygon into a waveform, and this map of the United Kingdom is actually a polygon that is a closed shape. So, a closed shape is uh, topologically similar to a circle, so you could. Uh, uh, make a point go around a circle and you get a sine waveform you make a point go around the UK map and you get this waveform so that's what it's about and then uh, we have Mondrian playing the sound for us in the background some balls are bouncing about making the sound using this waveform this waveform yeah so uh, we could do some things to this waveform so an interesting thing is the step parameter, so you could increase or decrease the resolution. So let me just uh, decrease the res uh, increase the resolution for, for the minute. So this is a very high resolution map. Um, and then we could decrease the resolution by increasing the step. The step value steps through the points, so we increase decrease the resolution by increasing it. You see how the, you see how the sound changes? It's nicer to uh, do it dynamically, yeah? So I'm going to keep quiet. Very nice. So that's good. That's good. You could do something even more fun. So you, uh, let's move these guys about away from the menu. Yeah, so the menu is there with us and we could rotate the shape. So there. So I'm going to rotate the UK waveform. It's rotating. So let's go 33 RPM. Yeah. Right click. So that's the UK waveform rotating. And you see the FFT the harmonics are changing now. Uh, so the background is still. Uh, the blue is the waveform, okay? So you could close the country's plugin and uh, you just have the waveform now. It's nice, isn't it? It's really cool. So we're gonna right click and stop the rotation for a minute. And it leaves it there. And you see the shape of the waveform changes. Uh, so this is a new waveform, so you can just rotate and get new waveforms. And you see the harmonic structure has changed. So if you want, you could undo it, press Z and that undoes that and you get back to this harmonic, which is mainly the first harmonic. So Shift Z will undo it and you get more harmonics there and you get the waveform there. So undo that, back that. Uh, you could use other plugins if you want. So let's say I use the XY Warper to warp the space. So warp the waveform, warp this guy. So I'm just going to press apply there and uh, it warps it. See that? So it warps it to add some more harmonics there. So yeah, so undo, yeah, redo, warping. Okay, so you could go to the warp curve and really go crazy if you want so I'm just gonna green is for X and uh, uh, red is for Y so I'm gonna have a have the X change very dramatically very quickly uh, and the Y is gonna be sort of soft okay so I'm gonna go back and now uh, I'm gonna let me undo it to get back to the old shape and then now I'm gonna apply yeah so Oh boy, you see how the timbre has changed and shaped the waveform. So you could play with that. So, yeah. So that's the sound of UK. Oh, sound of UK. Ministry of UK. Ministry of UK. Alright, see you on the next one. Good night. Where's Mondrian? There it is. There's the balls. Let's slow them down.
that's good so the delay line will take us to the end okay thank you for watching see you on the next one